Hi guys, right today we have come to uh, an, an old lime works in Buxton. Uh, it's apparently it's been shut for a number of years, so there's a couple of different places, a few bits and bats to see. So we were just passing, so we thought we'd come and show you guys anyway. I hope you enjoy the video. Yeah, today is a beautiful part of the world is this Buxton in Derbyshire obviously in the UK as you can see the road is all the way down there yeah so we believe this bit that we're on now used to be uh, some sort of railway track uh, obviously to move the uh, lime away basically so guys look at this this is part of the uh, the works there we, we will have a look at this on the way back because so we can go up the other path there to get in it so we will have a look on the way back Ah, if you look there, they look like old railway sleepers or something on oh, no, it. Is it railway sleepers? Yeah, some bolts in it, so it could be railway sleepers. Yeah, but this is the. Uh, yeah, that's the old building there. One of them, anyway. He's blown down. If you like, look at this here. This looks like it used to be an entrance to somewhere, and they've, they've bricked it up. So if you look at the top, it's got the wood, and they're like a railway track, old railway tracks. I don't know if you can see in there, see, oh no, it's just there. Yeah. Watch all these twigs here, sweetheart. This is this here is apparently where the uh, lime, used, lime used to come down to the tracks so they could put it inside the uh, the actual uh, things. We believe this were like the the mine part of it where We'll have a look inside them soon. Yeah, let's have a look down here and see. Uh, 
there's another structure. I think that's it for the. Uh, I don't think there's anything else down here. Yeah, this is just the tracks now, where the tracks used to be. Yeah, so this is the old, the old lime uh, actual works here. We will go up the other path just to see if we can show you what's at the top of it. But apparently there's uh, things inside them holes, so we'll we'll take you inside there and we'll show you them. Yes, yeah, so if we look here, what the thing, what we think is that the train used to come through this bit with this at the side. So this would have been tracks all here, going all the way along, and up there underneath the arches, uh, and then the they would have filled it from inside there. Uh, filled the lime into the train So Let's have a look and see see what we can see uh, It's just a an immense structure is that just to hold all that up there Yeah, so we're gonna have a look inside these little tunnel things over here And then we'll walk up the other path so we can show you on top of it. My man Kay. And I'd love to know if anybody knows who paints these snake things. I need to know who they are. Mm. Well, so next to Just be really careful coming up there. Yeah, that's a new hinge, is that though, isn't it? Yeah, okay, guys, so... Yeah, this is the... Uh, inside the... Uh, I thought we'll go up to the top and have a look from the top as well. Well, we'll have to walk up that bit of a track. Well, that's one there, guys, but we'll walk straight past it and we'll do that one on way back. Hey, guys, so this is what's inside. This is what we believe is where they got the uh, the lime would have come down them chutes. Yeah, it's just lime on the inside of there. Lime would have come down them chutes, obviously over the top of these holes, uh, and then it had dropped into some sort of baskets or whatever. So that they could have carried it to the train, which is just there. Yeah, so... Drop it through the, where they bricked it up. If you see there, guys, I mean, look at the... Where the, the rock face is just here. Oh, you can see where, yeah, the, where they bricked it up, can't you? Yeah, they bricked these up. The shoot's behind it. Yeah. And it would have just rolled across there into, say, I just said, have a little carriage or something. And then they've wheeled them out to the train, a bit. Even wheelbarrows. Mm, I'm just with wheelbarrows, but I know what you mean. Oh, they might have been a chute, might they? In a conveyor belt, or... Yeah. Oh, look at the old, uh, the, the stalactite there. And the lime. Just think how much weight's above here. I know, it's a bit scary really. It took me sat in a... Yeah, so these are... Let me say, where we think the line must have come down through the chutes there. And then down over here. 
I had to go to the train out there. Yeah, so they'd have come from there and down here, and then this would have been where the train or some sort of carriage or whatever would have been uh, would have come along. Yeah, because look, sorry, if you look at the holes up there, they would have been holding some sort of beams or like. Um, yeah, I think they would have been, yeah. Or like maybe like a thing where it, the weight of it would have. Like the oh look there, stuff. that one's got the wood in. Yeah. So I wonder if it were like, yeah, the, uh, I wonder if it were metal inside the wood and the yeah. wood was just to, and maybe it maybe carried it out. Because on... look, look, there's like holes up there, so there must have been something to support the weight yeah. of putting it in the truck. Yeah, probably. Like big buckets, you know. That yeah. Out. Like a bucket line. Tipped out at the bottom. Well, well, no, because they have small ones. Yeah, and this is another one here, guys. Another red brick arch. And it's the same, same as the other one. But as you can see, guys, these are still, uh, these have all been sealed up the same. Yeah. Yeah, it is a little bit, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, let's see all the, all the rock first there. Yeah, so they were like built up on the sides. I wonder if somebody could stand on that. Mm, I'm checking it. It's only on one side that there's a. Oh, yeah. Must have been an awful job. Very dusty, I would say. Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, there's one here as well, look. Yeah, look at mate, Michelle's just found the old light. So obviously the person would have stood here on this platform, what we think. Yeah. Which is made out of wood. And they would have sorted through whatever were coming off the conveyor. Uh, down the chute, sorry. Uh, and that would have been their form of light to I wonder if they, they vibrated this thing at the bottom. No, no. But what's in it? Nothing. That didn't vibrate. It's just the, the, the sheer size of the rocks that look them down, it'll have been. But if you, if you, some of them, like that one's got a cover over the holes. Yeah. The ones in there didn't. Yeah, well they all have covers, they've just been bent up. Uh, I think they, they used to have it with the holes on. So that it'd catch the, the small bits would small go underneath bits, and yeah. then now they put the plate over so they just got yeah, everything. I don't know where that's from, but that looks old. Yeah, it's a can, isn't it? Oh is it? Yeah, yeah it's bottom of a coke can or something. It takes fifty years for a coke can to go back to ground. Okay. Yeah, amazing structure as this goes. See, like, like Michelle was just saying a bit ago off camera, that uh, we come to places like this because so that you gives you guys a chance to actually see it. Uh, because it's not sort of the place where everybody would come to actually see. So. And, it, and it's not going to be here forever. No. So why not let us share it with you? So you could experience this, because how many people would know it's here? Yeah. And it's an amazing structure. So we'll go and have a look up on the top now to see. Hey guys, it's like there's a parts of a building there or whatever, unless it was just the wall. And there's this structure here. We'll have a look at that on his way back down. Oh, see, like a chimney on top. This must have been like a, a, a little work hut for them. It might have been. One there, one there, oh one yeah, there. might have been the showers or the there's office. There's another one
Yeah. Yeah, I just dug on that end because it's. Oh, these are where the holes were. Yeah, so these are the holes where I'm stood on one, guys. And they'll have brought the limestone from over there where them rock climbers are. Yeah, these will have been the holes where they've can't see it now. A bit like say these will have been the holes where it'll have gone down to the chutes. One, two, three, four. Oh, there were four. Yeah. So that'll split into two, that'll split into two and these two will split into two. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. It's like a, a bent railway track. <clears throat> and then obviously guys they've capped it off uh, so that Kids can't go in. Yeah, so that's been where they put the uh, lime down, and this must have been the quarry here where they've they've got it all from. Don't know what this one must have been. Something to do with it. Yeah, if you look there, guys, that must be the the actual quarry where they took the stone from. Yeah, there's some rock climbers over there, a minute. Yeah. Cool. Hey yeah, guys, this is the uh, down the chimney of the the roof of the one of the buildings. So I'm just gonna go and have a look in. I'll come out I'll come out the other end. Oh, oh no I walk because I can't fit in the hole. I'll climb over the other side. Can't fit in that hole. Got like loads of little rooms inside. Yeah. That's it from this explore from the uh, li old lime works at Buxton. Uh, you've seen what we've seen. Uh, hope you've enjoyed it. Don't forget to uh, check out my Patreon and uh, Facebook, Instagram, 
all that things. Don't forget, I'm here with Urbex Michelle. Go and check out Urbex Michelle's stuff. Uh, and uh, we'll see you on the next video.